I'm Matt Rank. I'm one of the allergy, asthma, and immunology doctors here at Mayo Clinic in Rochester. I'm assistant professor of medicine and consultant in allergic diseases. Today I'd like to talk about asthma action plans. A an asthma action plan really is a document that you can use to help manage your asthma. It's something that you and your doctor or provider can work together to create to give you some power over, over this uh, tough chronic disease. The, the things that you want to think about and have in your action plan are the medications that you take, how you take them, when you take them, if you need to change them for any reason. You want to you have in there what your triggers may be, common triggers like getting a cold, a, a specific allergen, maybe cat, or, um, or for example, exercise uh, are triggers that are often, often listed. And third, you, and perhaps most important, you really want to know what to do if your asthma gets worse. If you start having a flare-up, an attack, or an exacerbation, you want to work that out with your provider ahead of time so you know what to do. Examples of things to do would be things like taking your rescue inhaler more, or starting an, uh, a steroid pill, or going to the emergency department or hospital if your symptoms are bad enough. Well, I'd encourage each of you to think about these particular things Ask yourself if you have a pretty good idea what to do if your asthma gets worse, and think about talking to your provider about an asthma action plan and working together to make one that will work for you.